Dear Lord, we're so glad we could be here this day. We waited a long time for this, and there is no more joyous occasion when all, this, all these people can be together as friends and family, and a new family started. Don't start. <laughs> you don't start. <laughs> we'll survive. What a happy day. Yeah. Where <laughs> was my dad? Eight years ago. He passed away about well, since 2018. Yeah, so five years ago. They were. <laughs> I love you so much. Wow. Uh, wow. What do you think? Great. <laughs> Good? Yeah. Okay, well, I have to. See, why am I crying already? <laughs> One last. What are these? <laughs> I can remember when Bo called to ask for us, ask for a Mary Jo's hand to ask her to marry her, and I thought, wow, I was really impressed with Bo. I thought that was really cool. So I found what I never thought I would, the unexpected to which has forever changed my life. I read that a successful marriage requires falling in love many times. Oh, he's with the same person. Who gives Mary to Bo? We do. Who gives Bo to Mary? I In Ecclesiastes 4, verse 9 through 12, it's two people are better off than one, for they can help each other succeed. If one person falls together, one can reach out and help, but someone who falls alone is in real trouble. Likewise, two people lying close together can keep each other warm, but how can one be warm alone? A person standing alone can be attacked and defeated, but two can stand back to back and conquer. Three are even better, for a triple braided cord is not easily broken. 
Your papa made these for you too. Bow. As you see, there's a cord. There's three strands. The middle one is God. And we hope and pray he follows you every day the rest of your lives together and blesses you deeply. The other two are you two. But I say, looking out, you have so much more than three cords. You've got all these beautiful children, brothers, sisters, family, cousins, friends, mamas. <laughs> so it's really more than three, but those are the main three, God, Bo, and Mary. I vow to give you 90% on the days that you can only give 10%, to stand beside you on your worst days and thrive with you on your best. I vow my loyalty, faithfulness, and respect to you. I will challenge you, dream with you, and always be your safe place. I vow to love you more, more than yesterday, but not as much as tomorrow. You continually give me a reason to make the best choices, to be the best person I can be, and I promise to do my best to show you every day. I vow to never get tired of hearing or saying I love you because I know that they are not just empty words, rather a promise that no matter what life throws at us, as a family or as individuals, we'll face it head on together and come out more united than before. She love like a river that twists and turns. It changes and flows, it's powerful and free, but it consistently finds its way back to the sea. And so like the water, I hope your love is ever growing, ever changing. I hope your love is powerful and free. And may you always find each other like the river fights the sea. Well, congrats to you, Mr. and Mrs. Bo Mercer.